Lil Durk goons pull up on NBA Youngboy in public, caught on camera. Lil Durk has been in a dark place ever since the passing of his best friend King Von. Durk has gone dark and not shown a social or physical appearance for the past two weeks. The crew have been affected deeply by Von's passing and have been seeking for revenge. What his goons just did might have been enough to call this revenge done. Welcome to Lime Report. Today we'll be telling you everything you need to know about the situation, one detail at a time, so be sure to pay close attention. Before we get into this video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment keyword Dirkio for a chance at winning our giveaway. Now, back to the video. Dirk has one goal in life he's set on now, that being to get revenge on Rondo fulfilling what Vaughn started. The so-called beef that started all of this had started months ago when Vaughn started taking shots at Baton Rouge native NBA Youngboy, all of that leading to Vaughn sprouting his beef to one of NBA's affiliates, Quando Rondo. Rondo and Vaughn's beef is ultimately what caused Vaughn to pass away. After we got the sad news Chicago native Davon Bennett, known as King Vaughn, passed, emotions started coming out like a wildfire, mostly from the streets of Chicago, as a legend that was putting them back on the map had just gotten taken away from them. Seeing all the commotion that started from this, you couldn't tell this wasn't just anybody who got taken away from them, it was God in their eyes. Now blood being involved, Dirk is taking every precaution he can to make this revenge smooth and simple. To Dirk, it's more than beef, it's considered war, he's doing everything he can to make sure Rondo doesn't see another light of day. From putting a million dollars on the rapper's head to allegedly buying out every seat at a concert Rondo was going to perform in Atlanta, Dirk is set to do this at one of his venues as we saw in leaked footage of a song he had playing on his friend's IG Live. In the song, Dirk said, we on him where his show's at. Do you think Rondo has the courage to book any concerts in the upcoming months hearing all this from Dirk? From how it's looking, we won't see a performance till everything cools down, or if it even does. The chances of Dirk being able to walk away from this without taking someone down seems far-fetched from reality. With everything that went down in the past, walking away isn't an option. Now that Rondo left three young kids without a father, it's time he learned his lesson. This all started from some small talk and eventually grew as the rappers decided to take this seriously. When more than rap started coming into the conversation, everybody saw the hatred the two had for each other. From woman to other sorts of things, the two took it to a whole different level. The threats just started rising and kept on going for months. Getting Dirk and Youngboy to now be involved in the beef with them just doesn't de-escalate at all. Everything leading to that Friday night where Vaughn saw the opportunity to get at Rondo but things took a turn when Timothy Leakes came from behind the car firing two shots. One striking Vaughn, the other striking his manager who luckily survived the incident. With Dirk's whole part in the upcoming events, he cannot personally take action. Dirk is facing multiple charges and is waiting for a court hearing. Prior to these events, Dirk and Vaughn were facing attempted murder and robbery charges of a man down in Atlanta. If he did choose to take action, Dirk could be facing life in prison. With his music career in its prime, jail time would ruin him and be the fallout of Lil Dirk. Staying safe around all of this is for the better, sending his goons is the safer option of the two. Being that he's so big in the streets, Dirk has the option to go send members of his crew to go do his dirty work. Wondering what's bound to happen next, we're left here to wait and see who makes the first move. Dirk looks like he's already taking his first moves, with cops having to shut down Rondo's mini show last night. Rondo, who took the news to IG Live showing he had a bulletproof vest and stating, I got the 22 on me, then just doing what he does best and mocking the whole OTF group and sending more shots at the crew. Rondo and his crew did not seem to be in the best mood as they were stopped at a gas station all outside of their cars chanting, we ain't scared, we ready for action. Now that the show was stopped, this could be a recurring event as it's not in Rondo's best bet to go out and perform with many people wanting him in the ground. Do you think Dirk's crew was going to be there last night and possibly take action? Everything looks to be getting serious. All the talk about sending shots might be happening. If it does, it will most likely happen in the next upcoming months. Not going straight into it a couple of weeks after is a smart play because maybe the two could work something out. Obviously, no one wants to see another rapper pass away. We've been hit with too much. Another one going down isn't the ideal situation. If you look at it in a way, Rondo wasn't even the one to take the shot, but the one that jumped onto Vaughn to shield him. That's all we got for you guys today. Thanks for tuning in till the end. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment keyword Durkio for a chance at winning our giveaway. See you next time on Lime Report.